last season on A Slap on Titan. You came to us as failures and degenerates. After training for three years and sacrificing it all, you are still failures and degenerates. My name is Aaron. Aaron Yeager's a dumbass. Yeah, he is. Honey, what the fuck? Hey, now, that's no way to talk to your father. Potential. Father. Right, potential. That's Armin. I want to see death. This is it. Aaron, kiss me. That's gay. Connie, you stupid bean burrito. Hooray for getting high <laughs> and knowing your limits. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Whoever gets to the training hall first gets to sleep with me. Aaron Yeager, we have brought you here today to answer one and only one question. Are you a Titan or a human? I'm human. But what if he's a potato? I'm not a potato. Fire the cannon. These three shall live. Pixis. I believe Aaron can save the city. Then it's settled. We attack. Tomorrow, I show them all, and no one can take this moment away from- That's my boy! God damn it, honey! Well, 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 look what we got here. My own son rubbing elbows with the general. No, not you. Anyone but you. Man, I knew my jeans would do something great someday. This is the happiest moment of my life. Honey, what the fuck? How do you find me? How do you always manage to find me and ruin everything? Hey, now you found me. Here I was, just tinkering with these cannons and getting super wasted. And then suddenly, whoop! Aaron's here! This creature is your father? Yep! No! He's just a sad, miserable ginger that nobody likes! He doesn't look like a ginger. That's because I'm only half ginger. And all evil! Aaron, keep your syphilitic insecurities to yourself, son. This conversation is officially awkward. I require a drink. Oh, well, step right over here, Mr. Bossman. Let me pour you out a scoop of this here cannon. Honey, please stop talking to him. See, I noticed these cannons didn't do much good against the Titans, so I took the liberty of decommissioning them and made the cylinder into something a little bit more useful. Now, I've been perfecting this recipe that'll get you real fucked up. Don't mind the dead bird floating in there. He, he, he ain't gonna harm nobody. Hanes, oh, please stop talking to him. Actually, adds a little bit of flavor in when you think of it. Hanes, shut the fuck up! Nobody likes you! You're not my dad! And nobody wants your shitty booze! Just walk off the edge, jump into a titan's mouth, get cirrhosis, just do us all a huge favor, and die! C come here, Aaron. I want to sniff you. Carl, shut the fuck up. They're discussing battle plans. I was so close to sneaking into the girls' orgy, and they had to call us in and cancel it! Hey, who said orgies? If you know where the orgies are, you better tell me, you maggot! I'm not telling you shit! It's over and done with! That's not true! Look at you! I know you're lying! Oh, thank God. Someone put that cowardly lion out of his misery. Does your stomach hurt after seeing all our friends die? Yeah, it does. That's what I get for eating gluten. Hey! Huh? You think you know pain? You should see what it's like for us in the garrison. I had to sacrifice a goat today. And that was after the group sodomy. I'm fucking done, man. I'm fucking done. I had to suck a man's toes today. Get me out of here. Group sodomy? Were you part of the crowd that conducted a ritual for Cthulhu? How do you know about that? We saw the entire thing from the rooftops. You guys are fucking idiots. Aaron, let me give you some advice. Hold on, sir. You're getting awfully close to the edge. It's fine. Seriously, we should have safety railings or something. Also, you are definitely not walking a straight line. Pixie's tipsy. What? Uh, back to my advice. Aaron, next time you have an awkward family reunion, just do what I always do and get plastered. He's not family. Whatever. It's solid advice for any problem. Well... Thanks, I guess.
Let's try some now and see if you don't feel better. Pictures like serving alcohol to minors. Uh, okay. What's in this? Just a little tiny bit of sunshine. Also possibly piss. Sorry, drunk. We have gathered you here today to retake trust and seal the hole in the wall. Ordinarily, this would be impossible, but recently, we have found a savior. A savior? Other than me? I now present to you, Aaron! Uh, I now present Aaron! He is the product of some really convenient coincidence that doesn't make sense and probably will never be explained. But all you need to know is he can turn into a titan. Using this power of his, he has the strength of many men and can achieve things that So, we're still on for tonight, right? Possible. Nine o'clock? The girls' yeah. dorm? I show up in the Superman speedo and blow all your minds, right? Don't feed us that bullshit, Connie. Just remember, this is Krista's final party. You fuck this up and I'll kill you. <laughs> I got that Latin passion! I shall now explain the plan to retake Trost. So, explain it to us again on your Stratego map. It's simple. While the Titans are distracted by a large human force, we'll send out a special team to escort Eren into the city. Once they reach the boulder, he'll use his Titan power to pick it up and seal the gate. After that, we can finish the remaining Titans off with cannons. Not bad, kid, but we'll need to move fast. It's inevitable that a few Titans will slip our grasp. The only thing that's inevitable is death! That is also true. I'm just grateful you came along, because to be honest, we didn't have shit. It's okay. I'm used to devising the plans. I used to practice scenarios like this at night when my homework and rituals were finished. Such a clever little monster. Was strategy always your passion? No. I actually used to have quite the future in fashion design. By the walls. What changed? They told me you couldn't wear people as suits. Now that I have finished explaining the plan, are there any questions? WHY AM I A VIRGIN?! All I want is to live on a tropical island free of furniture and potted plants and just have beautiful women feed me grapes all day! Why can I have that?! WHY MUST YOU KEEP ME FROM MY DREAMS?! Fuck this, I'm out! Bye, losers! Screw it, I'm getting high and watching have Mari. Have fun dying. I'm joining Hydra, at least they have dental. That's it, you puckered cunts! Bitches flee! Bitches bleed! Hear me now! If the Titans break through this wall, your families will have no choice but to follow back to Wall Cena. Wall Cena, composed of the very people who formed the instruments of your oppression. Imagine the military police lording over your loved ones, or religious freaks baptizing your family. Imagine how long our empire will stand if you flee. I stand before you today, not as your superior, not as your general, but as your fellow man. A man who wishes to take back the light that was once ours. My friends, let us not disappear into the night without showing this world what humanity can do. Let us not bow before our captors. Let us stand up. Let us fight. I implore every one of you to join us on the greatest adventure humanity will ever know. I ask you to dedicate your hearts towards achieving our first victory in a hundred long years. I ask you to set aside the differences that divide us and unite for one final push. And if need be, I ask you to lay down your life so humanity may live. We shall face the Titans in battle. We shall strike them down without mercy. And when we have taken back our city, when we have taken back our homes, then we shall finally know the sound of victory. A sweeter sound there is not. And it will sound like this. Oh shit. Blah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Sorry, drunk. Good morning, everyone. It's evening. Shut up. Now, I have it on top authority that you three are the best and brightest of the garrison. Ian, Rico, and you, dog boy. My name's Greg. Shut up. You look like a basset hound. <coughs> now, you three will spearhead the special squad protecting Aaron Jaeger. But first, I need to decide who amongst you will lead. I believe that I should lead the operation. And why is that? Because everyone here is obscenely incompetent. Quiet, Rico. Oh, go sob it out over a bar stool, Ian. That's a mistake. No matter what, we can't trust Rico. Agreed. Fuck off, dog boy. She's short, wears glasses, and is a woman. We can't trust her spinster ways. Ha! Sexism. Pexus likes. But you still look like a dog, so I'm not listening to you. <coughs> Good. Now Ian's a depressing drunk. He writes shitty poetry and masturbates to the sound of music. How can you watch the sound of music and not masturbate? It's a classic! I rest my case. Well, this whole debacle just made my decision easier. It's obvious who to choose. Thank you, sir. Ian will lead the charge. What? Why? Because he's a drunk. And Pixis trusts those who trust alcohol. This is a travesty. I'm honored to lead, but uh, I must admit, that's terrible reasoning. Shut up, all of you. I'm drunk, and therefore I know what I'm doing. You are dismissed. Go, and remember the fate of humanity rests on your shoulders. <laughs> wow. Hitler youth all grown up. Get out of here. Aaron, I know I've placed a lot on you with this plan. If you get nervous, just do what I do and hold an ether-soaked rag to your face, okay? Thanks, Armin. You're a true friend. I'm coming with you. No, you're not. I lost you once, Aaron. I can't lose you again. Kasa, no! This is finally my moment to prove myself to the world, to the military, to Hanes! What does Hanes have to do with anything? Shut up! You have always one-upped me. In training, you were always better. In combat, you were always better. Now I finally have a chance and you still want to steal my spotlight. All I ever wanted was to be the very best, like no one ever was. Aaron, that's Pokemon. It's applicable to Titans! And you're on the decoy group anyway. So stop trying to baby me, because this time nobody's sending you with the elite squad. Mikasa, we're sending you with the elite squad. God damn it! We'll need your skills. Let's move. I can't believe this. Why, Mikasa? Why? You can't achieve this. Fly, my pretties, fly! Aaron, how do you feel? I'm fine. Aaron, you look dehydrated. I'm fine, damn it! Quiet. We're almost at the insertion point. I don't see any titans. The decoy group must be doing a good job. I'm slipping! M Mike, I'm slipping! It's sliding through me, man, like White Castle. Mike, I'm slipping! Mike! Ah! <laughs> Here's some motivation, Jaeger. In this operation, a lot of people are going to die. All because of you. No matter how much good you accomplish, and you won't, people are going to die horribly because of you. Aw, uh, who likes freeze tag? <laughs> Hold it. Hold it. All of these people have names, families, and feelings in their hearts. Many of them will die for you today. It is your duty to make sure they did not die in vain. So many rail lines around this wall. Why can we take in a trolley? Jaeger, I need you to promise you'll make their sacrifice worth it. Jeez, all right. Hey, ah, me. Ah, fuck you. What? Not you, the fuck. Ah. Jaeger, I need your verdict. The verdict is, you're the worst motivational speaker ever. And I hate flies. My friends, Jaeger. I promise, gosh.
Here goes nothing. Green smoke round confirmed. Green smoke means the operation started, right? That, or they found a new pope. Those abs. Oh my fucking god! How many times do I have to say it? Aaron? That is go!